Here we go. Ooh, this sound. Uh, this boss battle's even more, even better in this version. Can't please fight. All right, let's take on. Huh? Yeah, get the dance emotes out. Huh? Wow, how totally bizarre. This thing isn't listed in here. There's a monster here that looks like this thing, but it doesn't list the name. Max HP is 40, attack is 4. It's apparently really good at transforming itself and other things. Maybe it's used that power to turn the villagers into pigs. This thing's a real jerk. Alright, here we go. Yuck, yuck, yuck. I guess I'll get down and dirty if you're gonna play like that, slick. No, you don't. Ah, nutso. There we go, 18. Hmm, time to regroup here. So you think you're a couple of heavies, huh? Well then, my dear friends, if you thought changing folks into pigs was impressive, then you're gonna love this. I got something very special for you here. Yeah, yeah! Like them apples. Now that's magic, people. Now you're fighting yourself. Ha! Huh? I'm a dang genius. Let's see if I can do this. Got him! Haha! <laughs> Look at that! I did it! Multibonk worked! Yuck, 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 yuck. Hold on. What? What? Huh? You beat me? Yay! We did it! Clear bonus 100. And 20 star points. You got a crystal star! End of chapter! Cleared! Mario defeated the scourge of Creepy Steeple and found the fourth crystal star. The people of Twilight Town have surely recovered from their awful curse by now. At this rate, Mario's quest to collect all seven crystal stars will be done in no time. With his back to Creepy Steeple, Mario sets out towards his bright future. Huh? We didn't- Whoa, are you kidding me? What a total pushover. Well, we got the crystal stars. So let's get out of here. Huh? But wait. What are we doing here? Huh? Interesting. This is where the real challenge begins. This is where the part I'm not a big fan of when it comes to this chapter. Let me heal up. So let me save here real quick. See? We're out. We don't have our partners anymore. We're just this shadow thing. Whoa, run. Oh. <laughs> yes! This time we'll take that Mario and get his map. With this super bomb bomb here, there's no way we'll f we can fail. No, not likely. Go. Uh. Vivian, hand that glorious super bomb bomb. Huh? Vivian, don't you dare. Does that huh mean what I think it does? I I never had it. You were holding it just two seconds ago. You said it was too important to trust me with. 
<clears throat> oh, you terrible liar! Stop making up stories to cover for yourself! If I don't, if I don't have it, then obviously you must have it, and obviously you lost it. Or are you trying to imply that I lost it, you little lollygagging worm? I no, of course not, Beldum. Well, we can't do much without it now, can we? Oh, you're such an idiot! Very well, I'm sure you must have dropped it around here somewhere. So why don't you go look for it while Marilyn and I take a well-earned siesta? And if you don't find it, well, you know what'll happen, don't you? I... I get punished. That's right, you little twit! So get cracking! Come, Marilyn, let's leave this useless little fool to her chore! Go ha. Oh dear. Well, this is the part I'm not a big fan of when it comes to when it comes to this uh, this chapter. Hmm. Oh boy. So in the original, and it looks like to be in this game as well, you have to make your way back. Twilight Town. All the enemies that you faced previously. All the way back. <sighs> I'm not the biggest fan of this, but you know. It is what it is. We'll get through it. Yay! Here we go. Let's go back through. Um, de dum, de dum, de dum, dum, de dum, de dum, de dum, dum. Alright, back we go. Oh, Nelly! Dang it. Uh, stick out you. There we go. Get out of here. I didn't want him using that healing thing. Alright. Oh, that guy's charging up. Oh, and that guy's fleeing. Okay. Well, that makes it a little easier. I think I can just do this. Yeah, there we go. It's a five, no matter their defense. There we go. Get out of here. Whew. Okay. Yeah, this is the most annoying part of Chapter 4 that I don't like, is the back and forth. It... No! Oh, no. Okay. Um... Nah, there isn't any way I can kill that thing back there. So that one you see right there that's back there shiny and, and such, that's called an Amazy Daisy. They are very rare spawn when it comes to these daisies. And it's gonna flee. Oh, no! Oh, I'm so dead. Oh, no. Yep, it'll do 20. It has 20 health and it does 20 damage. Amazing daisies give a crud ton of XP. They're really good at giving XP, but oof. They hurt a lot. Here, there we go. <sighs> and I didn't have Goombellas because, as you see... We don't have any of our party members whatsoever. Oh no! It's crazy. 
Alright. See, I can't even. I'm hitting the L button. We have nothing there. Good lord. That stupid guy took our took our body and friends. Oh no. Let's head back to Twilight Town. Uh run. I'm just gonna run to avoid these guys. Goodness. Hey, what's up, Slick? Been waiting for ya. Yeah, you're Maya, right? What a great name. And I really dig this body, too. Man, can I jump now. And hey, you're so popular on here, I get mobbed. I just love being you. Yeah, it's so cool, I don't think I ever want to stop. So, you figured it out by now, right, Slick? Your body and name belong to me now. See, I got I got the power to change my shape in anyone I want. It comes in handy. But to really be someone, I need to take their name and body, too. Which means you, you turn into a shadow and can't use your name. Tough break, Slick. That's not enough, either. I am to erase you for good. I guess it's, it'd be unsporting, unsporting to ruin you without a challenge, so I'll give you a chance. If you can guess my real name, then I'll give you back your name and body. What do you say, Slick? This will be fun, right? Now guess, what's my name? Hit me with your best shot. As you see here, something seems to be missing. So I'm just going to enter in something. I know what his name is, but he always says Slick. Wrong Amundo, little nobody. Who to name their kid that? Prepare for doom, Slick. Yuck, 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 yuck. And don't even think about running from battle, you hear? No running. So, you can you fight yourself here, but you, uh... You're not thinking about running away, are you? You better not be. So you'll deal no damage to this guy, he'll deal no damage to you. So the best thing to do is run away in this battle. It's a guarantee. Like, you can't... You have to run. Nothing you can do. Aww, that's no fun. Look, everyone's back. <laughs> now that Mario took care of the curse monster, I don't have to guard the gate. But here I am, doing it anyway. Yeah, just keep the weirdos out, you know? Yeah, you look kind of weird. If I had to classify you, you'd be a bad guy. Uh-oh. The curse has been lifted since Mario beat that bad, bad ghost. And, that's per and that perfect red cap, those scuffed blue overalls, he's the absolute best. Why don't we... Why don't you do something about your appearance and spiff up like Mario, huh? I've been thinking lately. I don't really want to be a pig, but being a crow could be okay. Because I, then I could fly. No one has ever heard of a flying pig. Oh. Can I use this? Nope. Pipe project you. Gosh darn. Oh no, I already talked to him. What? Oh. No one through. You can't. Why were you in here while I was gone? Answer me. Perhaps I don't want to know. No. Uh, no, I, I do. Tell me. It's my shop. She's my wife. I don't want to have to use a ninja punch to blast you out of here. Now speak, you cad. No, no, none true. Mon dieu. When I awoke, I was here. In the shop. I swear it. Je ne sais pas. Please, say something. Oh, this is awkward. That pig was my husband after all. This guy's younger and kind of handsome. What a strapping fellow. Perhaps it's time I traded in for a new husband. Oh, I'm only fooling. Greetings. Welcome to the Twilight Shop. What you need? Uh, I want a store. Let's store this. That. 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 That one. That one. And that. Cool. Anything else? No, I'm good. Thank you. Come back soon. Cool. The curse was oink lifted. That Mario sure was oink something, wasn't he? Ah, I can't stop oinking. What should I oink do? The moon granted my wish. I never, I never turned into a pig. Someone living on the moon must have heard my wish. Who do you think lives there? Little green men, Princess Peach. <laughs> Too funny. You must be a dreamer. What an imagination. Oh, the dojo man was here. If you're looking for the battle master, you found him, pal. Don't think I've seen your lack of mug here before. You got a name, tall, dark, and faceless? What? You got your name stolen? Huh, that's a new one on me. Well, anyway, I'm gonna call you Nameless Frank for now. You need fighting lessons, Nameless Frank? You know my you know my fights? Let me tell- I know my fights. Let me tell you. Wanna talk violence? Nah. Now we have See the Traveling Sisters. We're actually the three pigs here. Hey, we're the Traveling Sisters three. Yeah, I think we were pigs until a moment ago. 
No way, we're not pigs. But if we were, we'd be such cute ones, huh? And this lady's back. Thanks to Mario, village is back to normal last. See Mario, you should thank him too. Even the kids are fine. Mommy, I'm hungry. Pork chops. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lordy Lou. <laughs> what do I do? What do I do? Poor me. Oh, dear. You know, you can get through anything if you have good memories to cling to. Now we can just figure out how my days as a pig qualify as good memories. We're free, yes! We're no longer pigs! I say yoink! No more oink! I just want to sing! You know, people often say that my shadow is faint, but yours is really something. I mean, you are a shadow. No offense or anything. Uh, what? A guy with a red cra cap and some blue overalls? That sounds familiar. Come on, Brain. Oh yeah, that's Mario. He's the adventurer who saved our village. Are you an adventurer too? I like adventures. You want to move in here? A shadow like you would fit right in. You know what I mean? Wink, 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 wink. I'm practicing my pig time. If I go to this one side, I'm going to be more positive. There's no more pickers? You're kidding. Could you give me some time alone? All my party members. Oh no. Oh, thank you, thank you. We owe you so much, Mario. Please take this as a token of thanks. Eat up. Boy, Mario sure got chatty, son. I mean, he like never talks. Oh well, I guess it's not too totally weird or anything. Uh, Mario seems kind of different. I mean, he's sort of like the life of the party now, I guess. so I guess it's cool. My, my, my. Mario's rather dramatic of late, isn't he? To be honest, I rather enjoyed his quiet dignity and strength of character. Huh? You want to know if Gonzalez has been acting differently lately? I mean, I guess he's more annoying now. What with the weird shouts and yuck, yuck, yuck laugh and stuff. Hey, ha, woo! Hey, ha, woo! Look at me, look at me, it's a me, Mario! Yuck, 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 yuck. <laughs> this is just funny to me. Okay, okay, let's stop. Alright. Let's see if we can help out Vivian. I'm looking for something very important. If I don't find it, my sister's gonna punish me again. It should be around here somewhere, but I can't find it. Gotta f push all the bushes. Nope. 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 It's in one of these bushes, I know. Ooh, fire flower. Hey, there it is. You got a super bomb bomb. Wouldn't Vivian be punished if she doesn't find this? I'm looking for something very important. I don't find... It should be right here. Here you go. What? You found it? Oh, thank you so much. Thank goodness. At least I won't get punished now. Oh no! It's bro it's broken! It must have broken when my sister dropped it. What do I do? What do I do? Oh, why does everything have to go wrong all the time? Here, let me fix it. Oh, don't even bother trying. It's really busted. What do I do now, huh? My sister will be back any minute now. Ugh. But I do appreciate your offer. Thank you. Oh, there it goes. Hey, wait a second. What's your name anyway? Won't you tell me? What? I can't hear you. Your name was stolen? I see. Well, I guess that happens from time to time. Wait, no it doesn't. Your name was stolen? That's, well, I'm not sure what I call that kind of a problem. Kind of a, which fits, I guess. Gee whiz, you have way worse problems than I do. And you're worried about me that whole time. That's so kind. Alright, that's it. I'm gonna help you get back your name and your body and your friends. Hey, that's okay. Don't worry about my problems. I'm not sure I really want to stay with my sisters anymore. Anyway, we aren't very happy together. Truth is, it took me a while to realize realize I was their sister, not their brother. Now, there's, now, now their usual bullying feels heavier. 
I also feel like I need to repay your earlier kindness. That's the right thing to do, right? Right. So, <laughs> here we go. Vivian has joined your party. Vivian's abilities. A primer. Press X to have Vivian pull Mario into the shadows where they can hide. Press X to hide in the shadows. Hmm? Oh, excuse me, good lord. Press X to emerge. Yay! That concludes the primer. I'm good. In battle, Vivian can ca set enemies on fire with her Shade Fist. Or she and Mario can hide in the shadows to avoid damage with her Veil move. Guess we need to find out that ghost's real name first, huh? That'll be a start. Now how are we going to get that kind of information? Oh hey, I have a sort of an idea. Birds pretend to be innocent with people around, but they're actually really well informed with all that flying and leaves dropping. With my power, we can hide in the shadows so you can listen in on the conversations without them knowing. So in addition to villagers, let's also try to get some info from the local birds. That's the least I can do with my powers. Yay! 